Lexus NX since 2014. Hello everyone! Some skeptics argue that the Lexus NX is in fact a slightly refurbished copy of the Toyota RAV4, so it makes no sense to overpay for it. For the most part, this is true. Nevertheless, the NX body is better protected from corrosion, although the iron and cell does not differ in thickness from the Toyota crossover. But the wind shot after 2-3 to three years of actual operation is overwritten by vibes. At the same time, there is no need to change it to a new patch with the Lexus brand. You can find a high quality front end from an extensive list of non-original spare parts. If only manufacturers would complete the car with thicker sign windows and more efficient door seals. And so from the owners of NX, complaints are often received about insufficient sound insulation for a luxury brand. But there are practically no crickets in the cabin. Apparently, they have not yet taken root. Let's hope that with age the population of this index will not increase. On board electronics are reliable. Although there were one-time cases of failure of the audio system and multimedia system. But the engines are trouble-free. The base 2 liter 4 is equipped with a chain in the time drive with the VVT I-Face adjustment system. At the same time, 90 second castling can be pencil digest. True, the base engine is more demanding than fuel quality. Servicemen still advise the 95th. On it, the form works more fun, spending noticeable less fuel. After 100,000 km, the chain may stretch, which will be heralded by cleaning sound and increased engine noise. Particular of viewers' manifestations on the cold. Officials change the part only complete with tension and damper. But the pump can fail at any time both at 40 to 60,000 km and will hour 100, if we get lucky. Basically, the water pump honestly visits 100,000 km. However, the replacement is not at all expensive, and you can save on parts by buying them in an online store. Particularly, you should check the condition of the drive bell, which with age can become loose and do a lot of trouble under the hood. The top of 2 liter 4 has not yet had time to acquire full statistical faults, although there is still something to it. It happens that the vacuum valve with the turbocharger begins to move. At first it makes a whistling sound and then completely fails. True, with such musical accompaniment you can drive for a very long time. But just in case, order the part anyway. The turbine itself is demanding on the quality of engine oil and is not afraid of overheating. Although motor engines do not need to set turbo times and cool the engine at idle, remember that before turning off the engine do not give heavy loads. On board engine, the control unit for the variable wall timing system VVTI may suddenly fail. The tail is expensive. For preventable pores, for both force dealers recommend to use an injection nozzle cleaner every 10,000 km, and after 40,000 km they offer throttle cleaning. Of course, the 150 horsepower aspirated can be considered the most reliable. The trouble is that it is combined only with a variety with which problems sometimes occur. This box doesn't like slipping off road or in the snow. In this case, cuffs appear on the pushing button pulleys over time and the car begins to twitch in motion. However, even in the worst scenario, the variator can reason 100 to 20,000 km. In general, if the variator began to work with increased noise at which, rush to the technical center for diagnostics. The reason is usually the wear of the cone bearings which provokes accelerated wear of the push belt. Worse when the car starts to feel in motion. This behavior is usually caused by vision of the pump pressure reducing valve, which gets the wear products of the pusher belt. In this case, it is changed and the working surface of the pulleys is polished. Again, in this background, the automatic transmission looks more advantageous. It is much more loyal to the turn driving style and has a more solid resource, about 350,000 km, and even more with time and competent maintenance. The all wheel drive transmission is generally reliable, although there have been rare cases of failure of the front and rear gearboxes, as well as the central clutch that connect the rear wheels when the front wheel slip. As soon as you feel an increased transmission rubble during its operation, auto clutch bearings and hurry to the service. If you continue to ride with the faulting order, then soon it will fail. And then you have to buy a new clutch and this is completely different money. But in the Lexus NX independent suspension there are no pitfalls a priori. Some owners, however, believe that it works out bumps quite noisily, and they will be partly right. Blame it on the crossover short travel suspension. As for its characteristic malfunction, bushing and stabilizer struts, as well as silence box of the front levers, most often fail. After 50,000 to 80,000 km, wheel bearings and front shock absorbers may need to be replaced. The remaining parts of the running centenarians. In addition, a wide range of non-original and affordable spare parts is offered for the crossover. So, everything is in order with the reliability of the luxury crossover, with the exception, perhaps, of the variator, which, by the way, has recently become much more durable. If you do not want to experiment with a continuously variable transmission, you can choose a modification with the top charge engine, which is paired with a 6-speed mechanical automatic. If you have a such a model, share information about what and how it breaks in the comments.